Blackmore is getting ready for the lunch rush. I love the fact that it's uh, I'm entertaining uh, friends and new customers. Oh, it sounds good today. But that entertainment costs a little more in taxes for downtown businesses like Hey Mambo. But there's an upside to where some of that dough goes. It feels good to know that, you know, it's just not the ballpark that's getting our money. You know, it's also letting people know that there's more to downtown than a ballpark. Almost a third of the money goes to other downtown projects like sidewalks, cleaning the streets, and promotion like these signs that just went up. With our new banner system, just providing a little bit of vibrancy on the street, you know, getting people um, used to there being some activity downtown, which is why I see a lot of different messaging, but also um, we, we refer people back to our website, which has some great map features. A group of Tolsons are behind the movement to market downtown, from promoting the good to getting rid of the bad, like the image that downtown is unsafe. Because I think there's a, maybe a stigma just because we have dark alleys and things like that, but, but it's really safe and there's a lot of activity, and so our job is to try to promote that the best we can. All things that could make the lunch rush a bit busier for all businesses downtown. And Moore says that only fuels the fire for T Town as a whole. You're getting local businesses that open up downtown. And that's keeping local tax tax dollars in Tulsa. Marla Carter, two news works for you.